If you see this warning message that this athlete is a member under two customers, please correct this. This means that this swimmer is attached to two different customer accounts. Customer accounts are what are used for anything to do with processing payments through commit. If we move, move over to the billing tab, you'll notice that it says there's even another message that says conflicting customers. It's very important that we choose the correct customer that Phoebe Smith should be on and remove Phoebe from the customer that she should not be on. This way, Commit knows who to bill when there's a payment having to do with Phoebe Smith. So if we select Phoebe Smith, this is the name of the customer account as well. Looks like there's an outstanding balance, there's some active enrollments, open invoices, and a payment method on file. If we choose The Smiths, which is the other customer that Phoebe is a member of, we notice it's basically empty. This can happen for a number of reasons. Um, it's highly unlikely to happen, but if it does, it's very important that right away we say, okay, this, was, this is an erroneous customer account. We have to delete it. Um, and by delete it, I mean remove Phoebe from it. This is the winning account. This is the losing account. As we can see on the winning account, the parent, Dan Smith, is also included, which is great. So on the losing account, we want to remove Phoebe. And there you have it. That's done. Now Phoebe is only connected to one customer account. That's how you solve that problem. If there happened to be, for instance, open invoices under the other account, um, like one meet got billed or something, all you'd have to do is go to that open invoice, click void, and then go to wherever the invoice originated from, whether it was a one-off payment, a registration, or a meet, and reinitiate the invoice for Phoebe, and it would get attached to the proper customer account. That's it.